thing we're going to do is take our shaving cream, shake it up a little bit, and you're going to cover your paper plate with a thin layer of shaving cream. You will notice that I have newspaper underneath. I would definitely recommend putting newspaper or some other table covering underneath so that you don't get anything on your pretty table. Then I'm going to take some food coloring and I'm going to do some drops of it. You can do any colors you like. It does not matter. I am going to do holiday colors. And you know what? I'm going to add a couple blue ones just because. The next thing you're going to do is take your plastic spoon or popsicle stick or whatever you have to swirl with. I'm actually going to use the back of this. And I'm going to start to swirl my colors together. Now the key is to not over swirl. If you mix it all up too much, then it's going to turn into one mixed color and you're not going to see the swirls of all the pretty colors. So I'm going to stop there because I still see all of the colors individually, still see them swirling. And then I'm going to take my paper. So I have like a small sheet of cardstock. The thicker paper, the better. I'm going to fold mine in half because I'm going to do this with a card, but you could do it with a flat piece of paper. You could cut out a shape and do it and do this and um, hang it somewhere. You can do any sort of paper you want, but I'm just going to do the front of this because I'm making a card. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to push it down into the shaving cream. I'm going to make sure that I get every single corner, every single edge, and I'm going to rub it. Then I'm going to take it off, slide this out of the way, and I have this mess. There's where your paper towels will come in handy. So I'm going to get a decent amount of paper towels. I'm going to take this and I'm going to scrape it off. And you can see that the print of the marble is left underneath. So I'm going to get a few more paper towels just to get most of this off. And there you go. Now, you know, I have a little bit on my bottom side too. I'm gonna go ahead and get that off because the more shaving cream you get off, the faster this will dry. All right, so all of my shaving cream's off. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna set this to the side. You can tell it's a little bit wet right now. And then when it's dry, I have an awesome card that I can write inside or outside of. And like I said, you can do this with anything, flat paper, cutout paper, anything you want. But that's how you get an awesome marble card. And you can do any colors you want.